So, I t so you hold this to turn it on, and then when it turns on, you wait. And then you see percussion. 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 High time, 30 minutes. And then there's this little pouch. And that's it. That is as loud as it gets. All right, Haley, what are we going to show everybody today? Aflo vest. Can we show them the Aflo vest? The Aflo vest. The Aflo vest, that's right. All right, so recently, those of you that's watched us know that we have received our Aflo vest. We were using our Encourage vest, which we have still used since we got the Aflo vest. However, with as much exploring that we do, it'd be nice to be able to take the vest and be mobile without having to worry about lugging this big thing all the way to the middle of nowhere and running it off the inverter on my truck. So, because if, hmm? if we use it on the front of the truck, does it drain the truck's battery? Yeah, so we don't drain the truck's battery, uh, which was what we usually do whenever we go on long road trips is we would use an inverter to run the old vest, but I really like the new vest. Let's show everybody. First off, what it comes with. So your instruction manual is going to be on a thumb drive. There's a thumb drive in there where the instruction manual is. It tells you to make sure you charge the vest. It comes with this little thing right here, wall charger to charge it. The vest itself is adjustable. There are requirements for how uh, tall you have to be essentially for your sizing before you get the vest. That's on AfloVest's website. I will put a link to that in the description below. There's a battery in here. Haley, I need your help. Help me. And it looks like help me, Haley. Let me show them. <laughs> it looks like this. Undo the. Uh... All right. Well, here. No, I'm I guess I'll. I will. Uh, I'll get it. Okay. So, just want to show everybody how it connects. So, it's got a battery pack in here. Like it said. Yeah, like it says on the cable there. It plugs in at the top here. You can unplug this and plug it directly into the vest if you want to run it from the wall. So, for whatever reason, this is dead and um, doesn't have a charge. You're still able to plug this in and still able to use it. It has motors on the inside that work the different quadrants of the it's lung. Half Two, three, four. Yeah, 4%. And this is what the FLOS looks like. This is the battery. Yep, that's, that's the instruction Except card that not, you have put sideways so people not, can't see it. It's not gold. It's not actually gold. It's actually. It's just because it's, it's a picture through the plastic. That's why it's got this thing over it. So this vest is a bit heavier than the Encourage vest. It was way lighter, but no tubes. You don't have any tubes connected to you. While she is uh, struggling to put that on there, the Aflo vest has three different modes. It has percussion, drainage, and vibration. What's vibration? The vibration setting, it just, the motors run constantly and it just shakes. She's not a big fan of the vibration mode. Uh, at least when we, we tried it out. So we stick to the percussion mode. We turned it all the way up so it's on its highest setting to work the different quadrants in her lungs. Are you demonstrating? Daddy, do you know what you should do? What? On this. I'm not gonna put a poop emoji on it. That still works. It still does what it is supposed to do. So what's great though, instead of bringing this big box and then I'm using it as a dog blocker right now over in the corner there to, instead of having to bring those two big things whenever we go somewhere and we only have to bring that one bag. What dog? And then if we have enough charge in the vest, we don't even have to bring that bag because we can get a couple days out of one charge. So that's pretty cool. Hey, you're un you're unzipped. What are you doing? 
Get over here. <laughs> All right, one thing you have to keep on about, which is a constant struggle with us, is making sure that her straps stay tightened because somebody loosens them up. I don't loosen them up. Allegedly, she doesn't loosen them up. I don't. Okay, well, now that we've uh, covered that. I promise. All right, why don't you go ahead and turn it on? We will let show everybody how quiet it is compared to the old vest. So, so you hold this to turn it on, and then when it turns on, you wait, and then you see per, percussion, 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 high time, 30 minutes. And then there's this little pouch right here. And that's it. That is as loud as it gets. Daddy. And she is fully mobile. Daddy. Yeah, Haley. Can you put a dizzy emoji, emoji where this is when I say it's upside down? Because people no. get dizzy when they're upside down. No. It would be bad. To give you an idea, based off of that sound right there, that's how loud that is. Based off of the normal vest which we will fire up here and you'll be able to tell an immediate difference in how loud it is. All right, wait, that's probably not the best test because I didn't have everything hooked up. So I will cut back with the tubes actually connected and then the vest actually connected to give you a better, a better sound comparison. All right, just like that, magic. I got it connected as if she was in the other vest. Sound comparison. Fairly quiet. Not super loud. But. This is how tight I feel it. This is how fair. Well, yeah, because it works the different quadrants in your lungs. I will also have a link to the vest that, that'll pop up in the top right hand corner if you want to go check out that video we did showing you how the vest works when she's hooked up to the regular vest. Yeah, much quieter, huh? She's like a squishy. It's like a squishy? All right, that's enough of that. Hey, Bug, you got anything else to say before we end the video? Yeah. Keep on. Keep on fighting and don't get corona. What about folks that have cystic fibrosis? Stay safe, stay healthy, and keep eating. Yeah, keep eating, because you need to gain calories, right? <laughs> yep, need lots and lots of calories. Keep drinking Pedia shorts. We have a big announcement next week that I will be fundraising again for the Cystic Fibrosis Foundation. I'm going to be participating in two events this year. One of them is a hiking event where I will hike and raise money that way. The other one is going to be like I typically do for Great Stripes, <laughs> where I will walk and raise money that way and if you have not yet consider subscribing because apparently as Haley mentioned in our last hiking video is that once we reach 1,000 subscribers I will be dressed up as a princess for one of our videos pretty princess yeah so yeah your support by liking and subscribing will help us reach that goal and then uh, you will see you will see me dressed if as a princess 5, for a video. If we hit five thousand subscribers, we will be very happy that I will dress up like a dinosaur. You're gonna dress up like a dinosaur. Well, how about we worry about you know getting to a thousand first? How about that? Okay. All right. Think, how much well, subscribers do we have so far? Uh, I think we've got like three hundred something. Oh man, that's not a lot. Right, maybe more people will subscribe. Oh, we're blue. 
Once again, it's the Aflo Vest. I will put a link to their website if you're curious on your little one getting it. Definitely talk to your CF clinic. Uh, that's who helped me out with it. Insurance was a breeze, surprisingly, for the Aflo Vest. Uh, we had it within a week. When I got the Encourage Vest, it took months uh, before we were able to, to get the Encourage Vest. You have a question? I have a question. What's your question? So, maybe we like, can we create it like another YouTube account? So, like, one for a little fun videos and the other for six hectare buses? Except all the hiking videos will go on the 65 buses. And then all the fun you videos, like all fun videos that we do at home, but not like, not like this type of video that we're doing right now, because that's a learning video. So I'm talking about like fun activities. Well, we do all sorts of videos that we put on here. We have hiking videos. We have goofy videos of us running up and down the stairs playing laser shenanigans, laser string shenanigans. Only once. There's only once, yes, but. We can do all sorts but of videos. But when we move into the new house, we're going to play hide and seek. Yes, yeah, so we are in the process of finding a new house at some point. Whenever the lot becomes available, we are going to build. Yeah. All right, thank you for watching, everybody. We will see you next time. You've lost your mind. <laughs> You've literally lost your mind. <laughs> <laughs> Get out of here.